Shemuel Rishon, 1 Samuel 3. And the child Shemuel ministered unto Eth Yahuwah before Eli. And the word of Yahuwah was precious in those days. There was no open vision. And it came to pass at that time when Eli was laid down in his place and his eyes began to wax dim that he could not see. And ere the lamp of Elohim went out in the temple of Yahuwah, where the ark of Elohim was, and Shemuel was laid down to sleep, that Yahuwah called El Shemuel. And he answered, here am I. And he ran unto Eli and said, Here am I, for you called me. And he said, I called not. Lie down again. And he went and lay down. And Yahuwah called yet again, Shemuel. And Shemuel arose and went to Eli and said, Here am I, for you did call me. And he answered, I called not. My son, lie down again. Now Shemuel did not yet know Eth Yahuwah, neither was the word of Yahuwah yet revealed unto him. And Yahuwah called Shemuel again the third time. And he arose and went to Eli and said, Here am I, for you did call me. And Eli perceived that Yahuwah had called the child. Therefore, Eli said unto Shemuel, Go lie down, and it shall be, if he call you, that you shall say, Speak, Yahuwah, for your servant hears. So Shemuel went and lay down in his place, and Yahuwah came and stood and called as at other times, Shemuel, Shemuel. Then Shemuel answered, Speak, for your servant hears. And Yahuwah said to El Shemuel, Behold, I will do a thing in Yashedael, at which both the ears of everyone that hears it shall tingle. In that day I will perform against Eli eth all things which I have spoken concerning his house. When I begin, I will also make an end. For I have not told him that I will judge eth his house forever for the iniquity which he knows, because his sons made themselves vile, and he restrained them not. And therefore... I have sworn unto the house of Eli that the iniquity of Eli's house shall not be purged with sacrifice nor offering forever. And Shemuel lay until the morning and opened at the doors of the house of Yahuwah. And Shemuel feared to show Eli at the vision. Then Eli called at Shemuel and said, Shemuel, my son. And he answered, Here am I. And he said, What is this thing that Yahuwah has said unto you? I pray you, hide it not from me. Elohim, do so to you, and more also, if you hide anything from me of all the things that he said unto you. And Shemuel told him at every word, and hid nothing from him. And he said, It is Yahuwah. Let him do what seems him good. And Shemuel grew, and Yahuwah was with him, and did let none of his words fall to the ground. And all Yashadael from Dan, even to Be'er Shiva, knew that Shemuel was established to be a prophet of Yahuwah. And Yahuwah appeared again in Shiloh, for Yahuwah revealed himself to El Shemuel in Shiloh by the word of Yahuwah.